Covenant School is fighting for a say in how much of the shooter's writings are released. Court filings show they're trying to keep some of Audrey Hale's journals in entries entirely confidential. Our Michael Warwick tells us why. Tonight, court filings show the Covenant School is against the release of parts of Audrey Hale's journal writings, specifically building designs and private information about school employees. Nobody needs to see that. That's not information we need to get out. And then two, we have to be very sensitive uh, to the families. We just simply want to be able to get an insight into this person who committed this horrific act. Representative Jason Zachary is one of more than 60 House Republicans who signed a letter Monday urging Metro Police Chief John Drake to release Hale's motivation for the attack. We need to be able to see what's in that manifesto that can maybe provide some insight as we gather information, as we prepare for special sessions, we work on legislation. We need all the facts and all the data available to us. Attorneys for the Covenant School filed two motions against the groups demanding the release of the writings, saying school designs and employee information could jeopardize security and privacy. The church wants that withheld from the public, something House Republicans tell me they don't mind. As they demand Hale's writings and medical records, House Democrat Caucus Chair John Ray Clemens released this statement reading in part, quote, Rather than reach across the aisle and work with me and my Democratic colleagues, each of whom is ready to return to the Capitol and get to work immediately on sensible gun safety legislation, the GOP is bizarrely focused on a diary, end quote. Ahead of an August special session related to public safety and gun laws, Zachary argues he just wants a better understanding, if it exists, why Hale did what she did. We need to be able to see what's in that manifesto that could maybe provide some insight as we gather information, as we prepare for special sessions, we work on legislation. We need all the facts and all the data available to us. The first hearing for the school's request is scheduled for Thursday. A judge will likely decide if and when the journal writings can be released June 8th. Michael Warwick, WSMV4.